So the water is our air, and so now we're going to add our clouds and our shaving cream. The shaving cream represents the clouds. The water represents the air. The colored water represents rain. Oh, I was always wondering why they always say it's going to be great when they're coming down. Yeah, it's raining. Oh, it's raining. It's raining! As the colored water saturates the cloud, it gets heavy and eventually it's so heavy that it can no longer hold the water. It rains down into the tub through the air. It is just like real rain falls through the air. know that the, the clouds get full up with water and that's you how the water comes down. Huh? Can it gets so heavy. Okay guys, you need a tank. Our next experiment is, is called foam. foam. But, but how I like to call it snow. I like to call it snow. You need to microwave it for for 90 seconds. So two processes occur when you're microwaving the soap. The first process is, of course, you're heating the soap. The second process is you're heating the air and the water that's trapped inside the soap, causing the water to vaporize and the air to expand. The expanding gases push on the softened soap, causing it to expand and become a foam. And that is what happens when you microwave ivory soap. Next we make a bubble night. So you're going to need your uh, parents help for cutting this bottle. Yeah. So you're going to cut the bottle. Whoops. Oh my god, no! Yeah. <laughs> I don't know that stuff that you want to cut. Chop it not yet. Okay. And then you put your rubber band around it. So it holds it tight. And a bowl. Best side. And then, like and then when we get outside, we're going to put some food coloring on top of here and dip it in there. And then Junior can blow in there and that'll be our bubble snake. So let's go outside and go do our bubble snake. Go. Can I try? Yeah, sure. Can I try? 
No, take it out. Whoa! I, think, I don't think you're supposed to leave this yet. Alright, now blow it at you. Hey guys, we're gonna make elephant toothpaste. You guys wanna brush some elephant's teeth? Not me. Well, let's get started. Me. So I already put my half a cup of peroxide in, in the bottle. So now I need Malia to, or here, I'll let Junior. Junior, pour this water into this cup with the yeast. Okay, can you stir it for me? Mm. And Malia, you could put a few drops of dish soap yeah. into the peroxide and then you can put a few drops okay now what do we do Okay, so let's get, we're gonna build it first, okay? Okay, so, so hold this upside down. We're gonna have it upside okay. down. I want the baby. Okay, guys, so this is what our bottle rocket looks like when it's all filled. And we so have we're gonna cake. add vinegar and we're gonna add uh, baking soda in it, and that's what's gonna make it explode. So all we'll finish this off when we get outside. Alright, so I already have uh, our vinegar in here and now I got our, my baking soda in here so I'm going to drop this in here and then I'm going to put my cork in and turn it over. Watch your video. See you in the video.